Fans all over the world are remembering legendary rock icon Eddie Van Halen. The master guitarist died today after a long battle with cancer. He was 65. To music fans, Eddie Van Halen was nothing short of a rock god. His band, a force to be reckoned with right out of the gate. Their hard-charging 1978 debut album sold 10 million copies. Together with lead singer David Lee Roth, brother Alex on drums and bassist Michael Anthony, Van Halen defined heavy metal at the time with monster hits like Jump from their decade-defining album, 1984. I can sit down and play. It doesn't matter, you know? I don't think people come to see me, you know, slide on my knees or jump. Thanks in no small part to his virtuoso guitar skills, Van Halen survived a falling out with Roth, scoring big hits with replacement lead singer Sammy Hagar. The Dutch-born Van Halen had been married to actress Valerie Bertinelli for more than two decades before breaking up, in part because of his continuing struggles with substance abuse. The couple had one son, Wolf, who broke the news of his father's death on Twitter. But his legacy endures. Van Halen is one of the 20 best-selling artists of all time, and Rolling Stone listed him at number eight in its list of 100 greatest guitarists of all time. And the news of Eddie Van Halen's death is a shock to the music world, as you can imagine, and other legendary rock stars weighed in. Reaction pouring in, first from Sammy Hagar, who says, quote, he's heartbroken and speechless. And then Gene Simmons saying, quote, Eddie was not only a guitar god, but a genuinely beautiful soul. And this from Lenny Kravitz, who said, heaven will be electric tonight. And Flea, following that sentiment with a note to Eddie, I hope you jam with Jimmy tonight. Of course, the late, great Jimi Hendrix.